Uh, the easiest, swing ain't, uh, the easiest thing to do would be when you log in, you're going to end up on some planet somewhere. Uh, this is a planet where you're lucky you don't have to worry about breathing. So if you want, you can take your helmet off. The only disadvantage of taking your helmet off uh, so far that I've seen on this planet is you need to, if you go in the water, you will drown. Uh, but anyway, when you first start the game, you want to go and you will want to find where your good materials are. You're going to need these to build things. Then you're going to have to go around and you look for things. And right here is stuff that you're going to need. Uh, there's a gun, but you're not going to need the gun real quick. There's a drill. There's some medicine. Then right here is where you get the important stuff. Oxygen, oxygen generator. This is called a core. This is your power. You're going to need to get some more power as soon as you can. So, what you do is you go over here, look for a thing called a fuel tank, click on it, and put in your fuel. Then, what you're going to do is you have to enter into the ship. And how you do it is you click on the front, you click T, and click Y, and it turns on the power. The first thing you're going to want to do, and many people may or may not argue with this with me, is you want to build what's called an assault rifle. And like I said, we could argue all day, but it's so much better than the starting gun that uh, it's not even funny. So what you do is you put your materials, and your materials are raw materials, in, and you start making things. First thing we're going to do is get our 30... Uh, power, uh, little power pods. And then what I'm going to do is look over here, see what you need for an assault rifle. Oh, shit, you can't make that. And that is metal components and electronics. If you look to the right, you can see it. So, you go over to the third one, you've got the little components things, and you type uh, one electronics, five metal components, more like the six. Eventually, that will get me an assault rifle, which is something we need. Once we get the assault rifle, I feel a lot safer because, in general, things on this planet are rather nasty and they tend to kill you. Now, that being said, not everything will kill you. Uh, just many things will kill you. And you want to be able to take them out before they take you out. And after I get the assault rifle made, I'm going to have to make what are called uh, these right here. Metal pieces, because the metal pieces combine with the magnesium and they make you bullets. I usually make about 10. If you look, I'm starting to get the power. I feel better about life. I don't have to worry about uh, dying uh, and not being able to come back because power is everything in this game. If you run out of power, you literally could have 100 hours in this game. If you run out of power, you're done. There is no more. You can't play anymore. So you always need to have a lot of power. Uh, one thing I don't know how to do is speed this up, so what we can do is look around. If you click I, you will notice I have a helmet on. And if you look down in the lower left corner, you can see where my health, food, oxygen, and stamina is. Your oxygen will go down slowly. But what you can do is you can survive in space for a little while, and you can also survive underwater. If you go underwater, maybe, uh, you can stay there. And I'll show you what happens when you take your helmet off. Maybe. Okay, maybe this isn't deep enough for me. Okay, I'll have to try somewhere else. This isn't deep enough. But anyway, everything turns red and you start dying. If you kick J, that turns on your jetpack and you can jump. Oh, there we go. Is I underwater? Yes, I was. So, if you're underwater, you can stand there if you have a helmet. But if for some reason you hit H, it should tell me that I do not have my helmet on and I can start drowning. But it's not doing that. Isn't that just wonderful? So 
So anyway, oh well, so much for that. So let's go back and see if we are finished crafting. Okay, almost. The other thing you need to do is look around for things. And if you see the little crosshairs come up, you can pick that stuff up. Uh, some of the stuff you can eat, some of it you can't eat. Those I just know for a fact you can eat. You're going to need uh, the fibers later on. And if you look in the upper right corner, it'll tell you what it is. But those are all necessary for later on in the game, so pick up what you can. The other thing you can do is check and see if you can eat the stuff, and you look at that and say it's kind of nasty, but if you click I and you click on it, you can say, yeah, I can eat that. But it will perish in 24. Corn dog is the same thing, will perish in 29. If you look at the fiber, fiber doesn't perish. So what you want to do is go find your fruit and eat it before it goes bad. It's a while before it goes bad, but I always try to eat as much as I can. If you look at this, this says this is a kava bean. That's like a coffee bean. Oh, my helmet's off. So, there's a water. Let's see if I can drown in here. So you're wandering around minding your own business and you see some water and you go, hey, that's kind of cool. Let me go hop in there. So you go and hop in there. All of a sudden you realize, hey, you're drowning. And that will hurt you. So you go, hey, I better put my helmet back on. Hopefully my stuff will be ready. And it almost is. So there's my assault rifle. Put that in number two spot. Go back to the bullets. Make myself some bullets. Ten of them. And then we will be happy. Anyway, that's uh, the very beginning. I will come back later on and do some more stuff. But as of right now, I just wanted to show you what I believe you should do at the very beginning of the game. Uh, other people may argue, but I am saying, hey, you know what? An assault rifle is so much better than a handgun, it's not even funny. Thank you much. Have a great day.